Welcome back to HodgePodge. The artboards in Illustrator are often used for multiple page PDFs or when different shapes and sizes are needed for print. Illustrator allows up to 100 artboards in a single file. In this tutorial, you will learn how to navigate a document that contains multiple artboards. When we start a new document, we can choose the number of artboards we want. The shortcut Command-0 will fit whichever artboard you have selected into view. All artboards can be viewed at the same time by going to the top menu and selecting View Fit All in Window. You may go back to viewing only one artboard at the same time by selecting the artboard you want and then by selecting View Fit Artboard in Window or shortcut Command-0. To quickly toggle between artboards, you could use the navigation menu in the bottom left. In this menu, you can view the next and previous artboards with the arrow keys or the first and last artboard. You may also jump to any artboard with the drop down menu. The artboards panel in your panel menu will display what artboard is selected and the workspace will visually annotate which artboard is selected with a black outline. The Artboards panel offers every option we need to edit the artboards. If this panel does not automatically appear on the left side of the screen, you can open it by going to the top menu and selecting Window Artboards to open up your Artboards panel. For more information on the panels in Adobe Illustrator and how to use them, please see Tutorial 3 of this series. Using the artboard panel, you can double click the number of an artboard to fit that artboard into the window. You may also click and drag a listed artboard to rearrange its order of appearance. You would likely use this with a large multi-page document when you wanted to change the order of its pages. You may double click on the name of an artboard to change its name. The icon to the right of the listed artboard will allow you to edit the size of the artboard, orientation, display, and more. The icon on the bottom left of the panel will allow you to rearrange the artboards. The page icon will add a new artboard, and the trash bin icon on the bottom right will delete artboards. That's it for this tutorial. In the next video, we will learn how to arrange and edit multiple documents in the program. Thanks for watching. Please feel free to like this video, check out my other videos, and subscribe.